With the everyday life and whatever is going on around me, it changes my mm. music, changes mm. my personality, my attitude, and mm. whatever. Mm. Now, describe the creative process of making um, Saneba, making Odo, making the subsequent kind of hits. Um, Saneba, I just entered a studio, a friend's studio, uh -huh. who is Niem. He has a studio called Studio 69. Yeah. I went there and Zodiac was playing the beat and I just started recording. Uh -huh. And then Niem also did his verse and I called B for Bona to also put I his love. verse on it. We just made a banger. Absolutely. And then I like the um, Despite. Uh, Despite. Despite. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. <laughs> and it's a lyrical wordplay for me. Yeah, it's man. a lyrical wordplay for me. But tell me how your observations of the music industry, looking from the out, like looking at it and the way it's grown since you started off in the industry. Where do you, what, what do you see or what do you observe of it now? Um, it's good now. We are, we are pushing Ghana music to the top now. Mm -hmm. You can see the Stone Boys, the Medicals, the Chateau Sarko Diaz, I'm playing bigger shows. Kim Promise, they're playing big, big, big shows around the globe and we we still pushing. Mm. We're doing mm. good. It's mm. better than yesterday. Mm. Yeah, and mm. with the help of social media and this dance influences, mm. mm. Ghana music is mm. growing. Mm. Come on. Mm. Absolutely. <laughs> and now, which new artist are you looking at doing collaborations with? Mm. Which new artist? <laughs> A newer artist, yeah. A newer artist. Anyone. Okay, okay. When the person is good, okay. we are good to go. Okay. Yeah. What are your thoughts of the new sort of crop of artists um a lot more yeah like the the, the new last mids the 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 black sheriffs like that crop of artists that are very gen z in the way they do things mm -hmm. what are your views on it uh they are doing good um i think uh, is their time now mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. there wasn't no more yeah absolutely yeah That's so true. um we have to also help them, push them, direct them in whatever way we can because we are all pushing the same agenda. Mm, mm, yeah. Mm, 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 mm. You, now, coming into, and let me bring in uh, the People's Martin, uh, uh, PM Extra winner, Martin um, of season two. Martin, you, first, you've been on the bus, you, you've enjoyed all the, the excitement that comes with the mobile bus. How, how's it been? How was it this morning? I I'm I'm blown away. Uh -huh. I, I didn't think that was the experience I was going to get okay. at the start. And okay. I would entreat anybody to try and get on it if they on get the a bus. Chance. Absolutely, because it truly is remarkable. Yes. Now, when you talk about the the, the, the music, um, and looking at a legend such as State J here, mm -hmm. what are your views on the Ghanaian music industry in general? I think it's come far, I think it's grown. Mm. Um, I think it's evolved. Um Looking at where the likes of Stagey and what they were doing, yeah. I'm casting my back, my mind back to concerts and looking at what he said Kim Promise and the likes are doing yeah. now. Yes, yeah. there's been growth and I think we're on the right path. And we are. We definitely are. Now I'm bringing in Helen into the conversation. Hi, Helen. Hello. How's it been this morning? Another exciting <laughs> mobile edition of 3FM Sunrise. This time around we were in Ashima. When I got there, uh -huh. a few people told me, um, you know, how to... Um, maneuver as far oh, okay. as my phone is concerned. Oh, right. You, yes. have, to, you, have, to, you have to be so a So, a few uh -huh. tips if you're listening uh, this morning and you are planning on going to a shaman for whatever reason, mm, maybe your crash mm. stays there. Okay. You don't put your phone, your mobile device in your back pocket. Uh, that's no, a rookie no. mistake. That's, that's new. Okay. Never do that. Even if you want to put it in your, your front, front pocket, pockets. if you're watching me on Facebook, uh -huh. there's a way to do it. Come uh -huh. for lessons. Okay, you've so mastered it. Yeah, that one, I'm just giving you a teaser. <laughs> but come for lessons. Put uh -huh. it in your front pocket uh -huh. and you tuck it. You have to sugar it in a way. You have to. Ah, don't sugar and see. <laughs> <laughs> I call, it, I, call it, I call it Street Wisdom 101. Street Wisdom 101. But you know what, I'm very street wise. Yeah. People don't seem to, to, to think so. People were but asking what, me. You know, I think you're in a, in a girl. Yeah, so, they're uh, like, oh, have you been to a shaman before? Well, no, I haven't. Okay, okay. That's, that's okay. besides the point. But mm -hmm. I've lived in, in big cities, okay. even in a place like London. Uh -huh. now, you don't, I saw this video uh, of some guy be on a bicycle. Trying and to the way they stream, the guy saw the phone. So funny. And, and people think that in, 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 in that part of the world, you can't have yeah. your phone. If 
you live, if you've always lived in big cities, you know not to to lose guard. Whether Debbie, Debbie, whether Debbie, you are in Obroni land Odeishi, or in Ashima, you have to be very very serious <laughs> in a big city. That was my big takeaway from the morning. I but another it. good good morning. Yeah. Eh, but we were coming to pick you up. Oh. I paid you, mm, but then what you happened? Know, uh, hmm, Ghana, Ghana. You see, I was like, you know what? You missed. Let, let, let you me missed so the you live hear. concert I, by I stage. I was listening to the live concert by stage. Oh, and the way well, you had to be people there. People were so hyped about it. Do you? Do, okay, you you took a bit of a breather for a bit, stay. Mm-hmm. Why? I've always wanted to ask why. Uh, I was doing other businesses and okay. writing music for people and myself ah, as well. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And you're throwing that for me. That one, I was coming. <laughs> I was coming to ask. Do, do you? Which one do you prefer? Writing. Oh. Performing. Both. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now, how lucrative? Because a lot of people think, okay, the Ghanaian industry is evolving, but how lucrative is it to be a writer in the industry? Um, it's not easy being a writer in this industry, and I don't think a lot of people are writers. Mm. They just get the vibe and just do whatever they do. Mm. But if you want to be a writer, I think it's a calling. Mm. <laughs> mm. I was only mm. actually mm. anything I mean, because yeah, always when I'm in the studios, I pray before I do a song, oh. and I don't write a song. Okay. It just comes to my head with the beat and everything. I tell the engineer what to do and we are good to go. Oh, really? So it's not just, oh, lay a beat, let me do It's more like you know what you're you know, doing. Um, when a song is supposed to be a hit mm. and the beat counts, the beat gives you like 90% or 80% before the lyrics. Mm. So when you don't have a good engineer mm. or even when you have the inspiration or you have the thought about the beat and everything, when you give it to the engineer and you both size together, you are going to, I mean, make a hit. Mm. So it has to be the synergy and it has to be what you are. So what inspires some of your lyrics? Yeah, I mean, cool. Chale? <laughs> yeah, but I heard you telling that it's, it's an unction, it comes. The spirit I mean, comes you can tell then. when somebody's lyrics are inspired by no, something. No, 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 no. Because I think, ah, how did he think of this? It's the wordplay for yeah, me. It's the wordplay. It's the wordplay for me. I mean, I haven't, listened, I've got to be honest, I haven't listened to Stay J's music in a little while until we started playing. And I was like, ah, Chale, the way I remember he, this. Hey, hey. Back to back to back I, to back. Some stop. of the lyrics, I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, ma- the man knows. Is, I swear, he just comes and he just like, you know what, let's start writing. Uh, but do, do you get a lot of royalties? Because you have endless hits. Yeah, um, I have a company, um, Songwriter, that is helping me mm. get all my royalties. Because at first, our time, people the, were just yes, putting our yes, songs yes, online on, and yes. taking the money. But Shall now, they, so all my catalogs were scattered. But now everything is together mm, and mm, mm. we're doing very good. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, what? What kinds of artists you? What, what what would make you say, okay, I'm going to write a hit for say AJ, even though I can't sing. But if I if I had aspirations, um, what would make you say, okay, AJ, let's work with her or let's not work with her? I can look at you or listen to one or two of your songs, and I know the kind of vibe or the kind of energy that you have mm. and where you are driving to. Mm. So with me, when I enter the studio, no matter what beat they will be playing, when I've made my mind, I'm doing a song for AJ. Whatever I hit that comes out is for AJ. Mm. That's how I do my thing. Have you ever had a song and said, Charlie, nah, this one day I want to keep it for myself? Um, wait, dear, wait, dear, me for me for me. I did, no. <gasps> I did the yellow chrome like this. I did it for Atom for free. Eh? Yes. And it was a banger all over. Didn't you ever say, Charlie, this one day I should have kept it? Sometimes when the, I know the song is going to hit, I'll just tell you I have to feature on it. That's all. Mm. But when it's for you, it's for you. Wow. Yes, that's how I work. Wow. <laughs> now, have you started working with the newer artists? And which ones are you looking forward to seeing writing for? Um, anyone that, that will contact me. Mm. Sometimes when I'm, when I'm in the studios and the new guys are working, I try to direct them. Yeah. On what to do, how to get it done, yes. how to create a hit, because you know how you know the template. Well, anything. <laughs> but in your opinion, what makes a hit? What what is the Ghanaian what is the Ghanaian formula? What do you add and subtract to create a hit? The beat is one, mm-hmm. and then the lyrics, the content, mm. where you are driving to. Mm. Because oya nyumna in kolan to mean toa, and your hit. Oma mean penso and your hit. Because some of the songs that are out now, within a week or two, you see that it faded. 
what is accounting for that? Isn't that because your attention they, span is so is so short they, that they, they we just can't got focus. an inspiration or they just had some word B O B you should normally try some of the A B B but they didn't compose it well mm. because what saying in your you think of controversy, you think of where the song will enter mm. and all that before you put the song out. Okay. Okay, and that is almost a, a, a winning formula. I know, I know. But I wanted to find out though whether you know is this new kind of dance culture that is also making mm. the music because you go on an app like TikTok, for example, every song that within 24 hours they've done a dance for it, mm. and then <laughs> on to the next one. I mean, we don't even give it time at all. As soon as a musician puts out music. Next thing, they want part two. They want more, yes, more, more. Yes. What are the days where you let the song marinate? You know, no, you're playing yeah. it for weeks at a time. This time, it's like fast, fast, fast. Want to make a dance <laughs> and quickly move on. Um, these artists are not doing the old style. Mm. They are just thinking of social media. Okay. When you put your songs on social media, you just have to go back to the radios mm. and promote your songs as well. Mm. Because oh my, I mean, oh, Papa and other people are not on the mm. social media. Mm. Mm. So you have to adapt the old style. Mm. Social media, and the many here. Okay. But okay. when they are on the radios, people, I mean, we get listening to it in the cars mm. everywhere. So that's how it is. Mm. Okay. Okay. So you okay. go to the streets, you promote, you go to the clubs, radio, everywhere, and then the social media, the social media will also take it part. That's true. Yeah. Is it expensive? Very expensive. <laughs> that is an average promotional budget okay i want even to even this. for dancers okay. a promotion for with the dancers mm -hmm. not less than twenty thousand gonna see this mm. <laughs> and, and and when they create a dance routine for it all dancers around the globe will take it and then it's kind of promotion people will start streaming the songs online then also benya oka if it's outside or Helen, AJ Helen <laughs> Dance Company. No, I don't want to spoil you. AJ. <laughs> I don't, do, I don't want to spoil anybody. Dance DC. I don't want to spoil anybody. So, but, a -A hey, so wait, this is, that's how much the dancers wow. will, will charge. You can call any of them and ask them. Wow. I knew I, I knew they were charging, you know, to put together their routines. But I thought, okay, maybe, in fact, they say around the 5,000 mark, 6,000, acquire when, maybe 10,000. So I think when it's a video shoot, when the director calls them, they say, for in charge. Mm. When you contact them for a dance routine with your song for promotion, to bang. <laughs> then that means that the, the social media attraction, even though it makes maybe it 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 doesn't make the song last so long, it also has its benefit. At yes. least once they hop mm. onto it, then you will also continue with it the goes promotion. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Okay, now when we are doing street budgets mm -hmm. from club to club, pub to pub, then throw in maybe some traditional media. What 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 kind of budget are you looking at? Oh like fifty thousand. Hey. But dance is not just say it's our budget. Hey, 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 <laughs> you know, hey. local club, we are one more DJ, we are like hey. oh, 500 Ghana will be in an envelope. Wow. Or a hundred dollar billion, she should be. be hey. So, we hey. have different currency. We have a Of course. Hey, I have the Wow. And the more bread. And yeah, it's over promoting you of late. It's not cheap. At it's all. not cheap. Not at all. Mm. Studios in the crowd, just uh, mm. <laughs> Then before you do all of that, and then hope that people would love it enough to put you number one. Yeah. And sometimes you can you can invest all this money and won't emfa. Oh, a bit. And you be a bit to me afa. Okay. Me you see Because with this being at number one, all that they pay for it, then they will pitch it. Mm? They pay for everything online. Some of the songs you see, they are at number one. They've paid for it. Wait, what? Yes. <laughs> I mean, they do that in other jurisdictions. You know, yeah. when I think what, what song of Rihanna's was it that the label actually decided that they were going to stream and stream and stream? And I heard the streaming farms and all yes, of these. Yes, they, they have people just dedicated to the streaming. If you put money behind it, like a big marketing budget, I think what Stage is saying is true. Anything yeah. is possible, yeah. but that requires a lot of. Of, of capital, and then you think about even your own styling. Even yeah. look at Stage's wrist right now, I'm it's tacked up. Chale, 
It's I tagged up. You saw it, it. Uh, Yeah, tagged. I know you saw it. In fact, I know even, you saw even, it. even from the shades all the way to uh, like, even, which was like, even, even the, yeah, even the outfit you have to, to stay put, fresh The outfit as well. is designed nicely. Like, what's with that? No, today is keeping cash. it cool. It's no, he doesn't want no, to talk see, too much. You see, the, 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 subtle, the, the subtlety <laughs> in, the, in, the, in, the, in the nice, it's like, pack it, package in there. One shout it. 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 One shout <laughs> I love it. I love it. Uh, so now it's politi- politics season. Mm-hmm. If someone said, "Stay," mm-hmm. I like the song. Mm-hmm. The song fits my campaign. Mm-hmm. Can I play the song? Mm-hmm. Will you say yes? Yes. Okay. It's you have no problem with that. It's showbiz. Okay. I'm afraid it's a mini campaign song. Grammy is here. Sir, yes. hey, you are not scared. No, scared of who? Because as soon as a musician, I mean, just check social it's, media. It's, it's, as it's, soon it's, as you make a song for a party, then they tag you. It's only in Ghana. Because mm. all, all supporting Chelsea, I'm supporting my you are. I don't see the differences in it. Mm. So mm. I'm working. So if you call me to do a song for you to campaign, I'll just take my money and sign some clause with you, and then you're good to go. And you have no problem with everyone knowing that Stay J created a sense? No. And no cry about my more market about. I think that's controversy. Hmm. I think that's controversy because somebody will ask you, hey, this campaign that you are pushing, have you read the policies? Do you believe in it? Is that why you, you are pushing it? You are helping them? So if you don't believe in a campaign and they bring you five million dollar right now to compose a song, just a song, be away to me, yeah, be Bobby be won't you take the money? Five million CDs or five million dollars. Or oh, one million dollar cry in Canada. Some me, huh? 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 Some Honestly, <laughs> already talking like a politician. I know, right? Yeah, I that, mean, that's, that's how it starts. You, you, you did the same thing. You know, you almost asked how long you wanted to cross for. Anyway, no, okay. um, AJ, I. Mm-hmm. No, I won't take it. Mm. <laughs> I won't take it. Especially if whatever or the group I'm supposed to represent uh, represents something I'm strongly against. Yeah, I know the money is very rewarding and motivating, but my conscience will hunt me for, for a while. Mm. So you are a musician. It's showbiz. It's, it's business. You have to think about the business aspect as well. And I'm a boy. Yeah. It's true, though. <laughs> it's true. You have to think about your career first. Yes. Because that's who you because are. Because if nobody is supporting you now, yeah. nobody is promoting you, nobody is doing everything for you, you are doing it yourself, and you are... Here with one million dollars, you t- you tell me you are not going yeah, to take just it because of morals, especially eh? if you are broke as well. Is <laughs> mm, mm, it mm. temptation? <laughs> it's a temptation. Mm. <laughs> Free money, Charlie. But I mean, what stay stay saying is true. In other jurisdictions, it's not the end of the world yeah. to show support. I mean, it is your right. You are you have freedom of association. Mm-hmm. You can align with whoever you want to align with, and it shouldn't be the end of the world. It's in our you know in our country, in our part of the world where politics permeates everything to a level that it's almost like Hatred. you know you yeah, are at yeah. you are at each other's yeah. throats in yeah. other parts you endorse a candidate they don't win or whatever the case may be it's, you go back you know to your life business yes. as usual mm, you can work mm, associate mm. with whomever you want but here it can be it can be make or break and i don't know why we have that you know that 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 thing about us sometimes so, it's so, too so much you guys being on the radio you yeah. should educate these people out that's there. true yeah and we try but you see sometimes it feels as if the parties the partisanship gets to them quicker than mm-hmm. maybe public um uh, information or trying to educate people on because radio these television. people that you are fighting over they are very good friends mm-hmm. mama is a good friend with dr Baobia. And you, you'll be surprised. Sometimes <laughs> they marry into each other's families. Yes. You know, they're having lunch with they each play. other. They play golf together. Yes. 
the right right horses in work together. Yeah, they can go on holiday somewhere, Mm. they are having dinner, and you'll be here fighting. You've worn your t shirts, it'll be a dressy, hot sun. I mean, you are not in Paris or whatever, Chile. You are here in the hot sun with Mm. us. So it's it's important that we become, you know, tolerant. Yes, we can interrogate each other. But at the end of the day, are we not one people with one destiny? Yeah. That's it. Yeah, that's true. I think we have to start loving Ghana first. Mm. And then that's the. We see everything, everybody That's else it. as well. True, yeah, well, true. But true. people love their parties over. Yeah. You know what I saw? I saw some of the parties uh, putting up billboards, and it was like a service to the party, but not mm. service to Ghana. Mm. So I want to be elected as a flag bearer. Mm. So I do good for my party. That's scary. Chale. And, and, and it's, it's been happening, I think, consistently over the last maybe 12, 16 years, where people just moved away from Ghana first to party first. But let's see, Sha. Let's see. Let's see how it goes. If, if they, would you ever hold political office, Stay Jane? Minister of Option. Enjoyment. That one, yeah. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> but if, they, if you got an opportunity to either be a parliamentary candidate or a minister of state, would you take it? Sure. Never say never. Maybe I'm in for. Okay, okay. Maybe okay. I could be a. Okay, okay. I like that. If they're like enjoying, that. I also have to enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, Martin, will you ever want to hold political office? No. Huh? Why? No. no. Um, I don't think I'll survive. <laughs> Reason being that there's a status quo, there's a system. Mm. You have to toe a certain line. Mm. And if you want to not, they will eliminate you. So I'd rather they keep their thing at mm. my thing. Mm. Yeah. 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 That one, dear. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you'd rather just stay in your lane yeah. and just focus on that. I like that. Okay. Helen, would you ever consider a political office? Absolutely. Mm. Mm. I like it. Yes, I'm going for presidency. Yeah. Four Jose. more to do more. Ah. Four more to do more. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> uh, but not the way they did the going for it. In the background now, 16 years, stay J. Now playing on 3 Lounge on 3FM 92.7. And the man himself is in the studio. Alongside the People's Martin. Martin from PM Extra Season 2. And of course, one and only Helen Apia Amprefer, aka Ruffalak. Um, but say how how was the bus experience for you uh very nice Mm, mm. yeah okay you you which which part of it was your highlight uh, where I was performing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. that was all of us. Uh, our highlights. Our, our highlights <laughs> me as well. Up, was, that was my highlight. It was definitely a nice way to, to end it. But the bus rides are always a nice opportunity to take it easy mm. and hear from everyday people. I love yeah. it when we're able to get down and, you know, put the mic in front of, you know, the everyday Ghanaians to mm. hear from them. People sometimes just want to release some of that tension. You know, you want to vent. It's like when you get together with your friends, you lament, you complain. It's a way of de-stressing. Mm. So sometimes people say Mukasa too much you're complaining too much it's all in a bit to de-stress let it out mm. don't keep it inside you you complain kakra you get on with it kakra mm. and that's how we get it done i love it i love it now we'll be seeing stay j live in concert we we are you considering doing like a headline concert for the fans i think last weekend i headlined a show at mm. a mad club oh Nice. Legendary night with Yes, yes, yes. I think I saw the, 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 yeah. And it was crazy. I love that. It rained, but the whole place was packed. Come on. Yeah. Mad Mad is, uh, it's new, isn't it? Yeah, it's new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's strict 24. Uh, Yes, yes. They, Uh they, uh the the 24 hour restaurant, they own the club, yeah? Yeah. That's amazing. Uh, I hear they even opened one in Eastern Africa, in Uganda. I see. I, I love the way Ghanaians. And Af- well, West African companies are now opening East Africa because we, they don't have the amenities that um, we have here. Like, we have so many restaurants and clubs and pubs. They don't have that many as much there. Really? Like, stylishly done ones. Actually, quite new. What, in East Africa? In East Africa. Interesting. In, 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 in selling jurisdictions. So, honestly, a good business... Uh, hey, back to business ideas, Helen. Okay. So, we have a thing where every Friday we think of a new business idea. Mm-hmm. We are yet to implement them, but we are, we are working on it. So, we'll move... Last week was deep fried Kusiani Meku. In our defense, was a d- 
designer pop up because any make joins. Yes. So pop up at every restaurant, no, no, every club and every event this Christmas. Hey, and we'll sell hey, 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 What do you think of that idea? Would, would you would you recognize? Yeah. 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 We'll do burger kosheni miko. Yeah. So we'll have little burger parties inside the kosheni miko. Yeah. You slice the kosheni and, <laughs> and then you add some kind of burger meat inside. Yeah, and then and then let you extra bougie. Yeah. Yeah. Very bougie. Yeah. 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 Last weekend, when we closed the show, yeah, a woman was selling kosheni muko. I'm sure she sold out around four, five, and everybody. Hey, 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 on 7th December. Easy. And that's why no, that, people, people they'll be, be there too. all night from 7th no, 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 December. No, 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 no. People, so people will be, be waiting for the results. I don't think they'll have no, time no, no, for no, the no, they'll, they'll, they'll eat Oh, they'll eat it. Yeah, yeah, as they are waiting for the results. Yeah. Okay. So we'll sell out. Okay. 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 So we are, we are, see, this is the, this is the, 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 the lights we needed. We are doing this. We are doing this. Designer could send me a What is this week's business idea? You are coming with something new. Talk to me. So this week, the plan here is to export restaurants to East Africa. So, we need a sponsor. We need we need like wait, a million wait, dollars. Wait, 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 wait. So again. we'll do like, you know, um like a really bougie restaurant mm-hmm. in like Uganda, in Tanzania, Malawi. in Malawi. That's why Nella CJ finances and yeah, invest no, no, no. in this. He business. will be whether he had, he's uh-huh. number one in That's why we've yeah. locked him here. Uh-huh, this yeah. is an unfair <laughs> politician. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how we we'll, so we'll do it in, in like different African countries. We'll cash out, we'll cash out. But you have to okay. do mobile Kushani Moko. I like it. Yeah. Oh my god. So okay, from, wait. So, so we have a like a branded bus, bus and then we just go with from, it. Ah. From one club to the other. Ah, so AJ has added to the business. No, no, we are there. <laughs> we are there. We are there. <laughs> we are there. After. I think the rest of the idea should not come out. People are listening. <laughs> that's, that's true. That's true. true. So if we, we'll keep recording. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you know the, the branding on the bus, how will we branch to something? Because if I wasn't here, I'd be writing all this and I'd go there on the seventh and be there. And be there. we said it first. You heard we it. You heard it here first. Yeah, each so of my If face. anyone does it, we will sue them. <laughs> thank you. For intellectual property uh, uh, infringement. Uh, hey, thank you. Thank you. Yes. So we are there. <laughs> but in wrapping up the conversation, what can we expect from you, Stage A soon? Um, are there big plans? Any um, big album? For now, I'm promoting Saneba, yeah. uh, which I featured in Neem um, nee and B for Bona. Wonderful. And I'm yet to bring my two-pack albums. Oh. Yeah, and I have a couple of shows around here in Ghana and London okay. and okay. America as well. So Amazing. Uh, some, Catch stage or the stage near you. I'm planning. Aha. Uh-huh. And all these promoters out there, you can call me for shows. How do we reach out? DM me on uh, Instagram. Mm. Yes. Ask Yen Kasi Kasem. As very TJ GH. Very, very necessary. All my TJ pages GH. are verified. Until Okohona and Yamiya. <laughs> so stay JGH on Instagram, on uh, Twitter, Twitter, on Facebook, Facebook TikTok, TikTok everywhere. Snapchat, everywhere. YouTube, yes. everywhere. And of course, most importantly, let's run up the numbers on the music yes. on all the streaming platforms. Look out for Stay J and just keep streaming. Saneba is brand new on the market jamming in every spot and on every station and of course more great music coming through from stage J in the next few weeks and most importantly the performance because the energy no the energy no the energy no that's all that matters the energy that stage J will bring on stage is always amazing the Martin what are we look what are we doing what is going on with the people's Martin what exciting projects are you working on um um started my vlog oh nice discover with martin mm-hmm. so basically it's just i like to travel okay and so i'm just capturing it and just sharing it with people now amazing so amazing that's so that, that's what we're doing and what, what are the big plans we have um to bring out um I have a foundation i spoke about is in the works mm-hmm. and 
the other things I'm doing. Okay. I told you I was trying to get into the media space. Yeah. Um, I yeah. tried a bit of acting. Okay. Out. I tried a bit of every every little thing. I like out. that. I like yeah. that. I like that. So a lot of uh, Martin is going to be on our screens yeah, in our yeah. faces. I'm going to be. Um, but for now, we can be getting all of that on the vlog. Yeah. Yes. On so my, how do we on what, my Instagram and on my TikTok? Okay. Yes. So it's that people's Martin. People's Martin. Okay. Both. Both on platforms. TikTok and yes. on Instagram, and yes. you can get the vlog as yes. he goes around the I'll world, take you the world. <laughs> and brings it to us right on social yes. media. But so, Martin, always a pleasure having you here. Likewise. Thank you for being on the bus, Thank JJ. You. Um, no, you, you do all, you do all. Thank you so much for joining us on the bus. You people do all. No, you do all. You <laughs> I love do the all. Oh, amazing. Back to back. Chale. It's going down like come nobody's on, Come on, come on. Yes, say Jay with so much great music out and even more on its way. And of course, you can find our amazing guests on social media, Stay JGH on all platforms. And of course, People's Martin on all platforms, on Instagram specifically and on TikTok as well. Stay J on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat. I, I, I cloud, wait, no, uh, what was it? I iTunes, <laughs> I was like, People iTunes, send your messages now. Uh, Boomplay, <laughs> Spotify, yeah, hey Fabio. Baby, yeah. Baby, yeah. <laughs> Gentlemen, thank you so much for coming through <laughs> and bringing this one back. This is Sunny Eba by Stay J, featuring um, an array of incredible hit makers, B for Bona, and as well, Ni M. M.